If you have a Thermador professional series oven, you have another great tool to consider using for roasting over the holidays, and that is the rotisserie. So you can use the rotisserie for a variety of meats. We use it for prime rib, duck, chicken, lamb roasts, pork roasts, small turkeys. The only stipulation is that the weight of the meat should not exceed 12 pounds. Now when you use the rotisserie, the lowest temperature is 350 and you can go up from there to 500 degrees. But remember that low and slow gives you nice even results and you can always have a blast of heat at the end. If the heat is too high, you will have more splattering and more excitement in the oven. Remember, use the heat to cook the food. Use high heat just to give you that luscious browning at the end of the cooking. Now, when it comes to preparing the meat for the rotisserie, Thermador's made it really easy for you because they've got these beautifully designed prongs that go into the meat with handles attached. But notice how I have the handles lined up so they're even. That gives me a good support to handle the meat and then when I set it down on the counter, it's sitting raised above the counter and totally balanced. Really nice design. Once you put the prongs into the meat, slide the skewer through the center and then tighten the small screws to hold the skewer in place. And when it comes to washing up, don't lose those screws. Put them in a safe place. Now, I always like to put meat into a heated oven, but if you heat the oven with the rotisserie frame in place, it gets a little bit tricky. Then you've got to have a towel handy or an oven mitt. So my advice is preheat the oven without the frame in place, and when you're ready to place the meat in the oven, slide the frame onto a rack, place the meat in, in the frame, and then you can push the frame back with, with your hands without fear of burning yourself. Now prior to using the rotisserie, remember, set up your oven so that you have a rack underneath with a drip tray and plenty of clearance for the meat to turn. Rotisserie, doing meat on the rotisserie, you have the same parameters as when you're roasting in the oven. The meat shouldn't be too cold and you should allow for a 15 to 20 minute resting period prior to carving.